There can never be forever flowers, no matter how the sun catches them in the field, bright in the reflection of elementary simplicity, where when why she runs through them, I run to her through the misty dreams of flog, splashing loud in the high, waiting deep in the light, which seems to ripple. And surely if we were watching from some great distance up, we would see great concentric circles ever outward until our eyes fell, and I could not paint one blurred stroke from the next. I try to taste the infinite, to wrap my tongue about it, to feel it, to understand it, know it, think it, breathe it inside my barely formed heart where my age-old stars and unknown laws flow freely down paths filled with words too long to read in a lifetime like my lifetime, which is only a short time, and then it passes on with all the interactions and inner reflections. All it is is its own complexity and misunderstanding, so simply I give up too weak to strength to know the need belief in myself and the outside me, and the faint unbearable possibility that as a stranger I can see all the way to the edge of the unknown and pass through it beyond it and touch it just for a moment, and something slipping, unending, enduring, but lost in me, so lost in me, but losing it is finding it, enjoying it is his very own paradox, I have to admit, in my soul to have a chance to be and maybe then I can fall in love with the impossibility of infinite indistinction of the great cities, the forests, and the miles and acres and streams, and the story ground, or some guy, maybe named Charles or Taylor, or whatever, set for a moment in the pouring of the contemplation. The interstate overpasses with their headlights and their speeding fast cars, going through the not here places and the not there memories, and then the distant dance back to the midnight when they burn out around the curves of the road and behind the shadows of trees, a blinking thing and the bridges, crinulations lost as soon as it is seen. The faces seen through the glass door fronts, and the children of all who will grow up one day to be another adult with another child in another place full of nostalgia for a time that did not exist and all those ghosts of yesteryear that made sense. Only the non-existent point, who in fresh and raw as ghosts sometimes live, they were all the confusion and despair of the day-to-day. -day. The used books with their hint of someone else's breath, a drop of marmalade, a crease marking a page. As beloved, the thumbprints and the smears and the words that someone else read in some holy other way. And the love story quest, such a minor refrain that is a major in the heart of a young man who needed above all else to believe in love as he spoke to air that was born in someone else's lungs. And before that, born of leaves, and before that, born of stars. Somewhere out there, a phone conversation turns dirty and mean, and the table in the kitchen is covered in all cigarette burned cloth, and upon it, a discarded cup, cardboard, and wax, paper towels, and dinner dishes, mostly finished but unwashed, and the whole pantomime of vignette is a grave for a passing thing that might as well be forgotten and dead for all the living it does. All the same, just another storeroom in the great big circus tent with over seven billion rings, most unwatched by most, and some watched by more. And all down through eternity, the rhythm and the rhyme steams, and it steams, and it steams, and it sings. Sometimes we are meant to love. Somehow we are meant to lose this. Some things slip our hands, our minds, to lie upon the more than all the sands. There can never be forever flowers, no matter how the sun catches them. Through the forgotten sound of my own laughter right after I swallow all the tongues and spoken things as she is just another thing that I try not to see but I fail to read correctly. And the wind blows strong from the November. It whispers the colors of an early autumn green while blowing leaves all around and down and out then deep in the chasms of shadows cradled under grass where she turns to look back at me and maybe smiles, but who can tell from where I stand? I only hope I understood her correctly, and then I run after her again. Thank you for the you, thank you for the me. Though it is not so easy to see that we're just another thing, I think I knew too soon. It has been a lovely spring.